It's believed that the average British garden contains over 20,000 slugs and snails. They can consume over 500 varieties of plants and vegetation, and consume around 40 times their weight in the space of a day. This is an age-old problem for gardeners, and hundreds of methods have been tried. In this video, we put five common household deterrents to the test. We immediately noticed a snail making light work of the pine mulch. The static shock from the copper tape didn't seem to phase these slugs either. Sharp crushed eggshells? No problem at all. Wool pellets? Nope. And horticultural grit again, not sharp enough to hinder these slugs. This raises quite a problem. No one really wants to use pesticides like metal dehyde in their gardens anymore. So how do we tackle these pests? We think the answer is diatomaceous earth. It contains silica, one of the hardest solids on earth. This irritates the skin of mollusks, dehydrates them and subsequently deters them away from plants. It's the main ingredient in our slug control product, Feed and Fortify. Let's see how it fares against the slugs. Once they reach the Feed and Fortify barriers, we observe some interesting things. Some skirted around the outside, never actually reaching the plant. Some attempted to cross, but then gave up and turned around, or dried out and began to lose their balance. We also saw that the granules stuck to them once they had slithered away. To learn more about diatomaceous earth, please visit the link below which is also in the video description. <laughs> 